Yes. What's up, everybody? Kaboom, dude. I hope you're all doing well. I am fresh off of work, dude. Fresh off of work. Let's have a vape, and then we're going to talk about, uh, I got a real good one for you. Actually, you guys already know. I don't even know why the fuck I say it, dude. Like, it's in the fucking title, right? <laughs> one day I'm going to quit doing that. Wow. Spectacular, man. So listen, today we are going to be talking about a juice company that I am super, super ecstatic about, man. Dr. Krimi's V-Liquid, all right? Uh, this is E-Liquid, made in the good old USA. I need something. One sec. Of course I'm getting up. Who doesn't get up? Honestly. So what I'm going to do here is I want to pull it up because I want to give you guys all the information that I possibly can. Let's see. So, oh my gosh. So my phone is completely jacked up, right? Which is buck nutty to me. But it's got this crazy shadow like building up the the face of the phone, so it's really hard to see, so as far as com uh, answering comments, I pretty much do the bulk of my responding on my phone, right, while I'm on the go, man, while I'm out there and working, I'm doing whatever I'm doing, I'm answering you guys when I get a chance, at work or whatever, right, email, stuff like that, and it's beginning to become hard to see, <laughs> very hard to see, man, fuck, that's good. All right, Dr. Creamy's V Liquid. All right, let's go ahead and pull up about the doc. All right, uh, he's a retired veteran uh, and an ex-smoker, of course. Uh, he has been making his own juice since 2009. Man, this guy's been at it. Uh, since mastered and perfected the art of mixing juice, he provides an amazingly delicious, high-quality product. And I agree, man. Uh, I agree. I have four for you here. I got one more on the way, but I figured, you know what? I got four that have been steeped, and I have been digging into each and every one of these. Um, so there you go, man. Uh, I'll write the website right here. He's got like some clones, and I believe he has an authentic right now, and it's a it's a mod. Uh, but nonetheless, man, that's not what we're talking about. We're talking about the juice here, man. Uh, here's what I got for you guys, man. I got fruity rings with milk. Yeah, dude. Beautiful, man. I got creamy cake with whipped cream. All right. A bottle. The the label's got everything you need to know, man. A little caution on there. Uh, the prescription number. Okay. Kind of a play off a doctor or whatnot. All right. Creamy jacks. All right. That's like a play off of a uh, cracker jacks. All right. Um, and also a root beer float with extra ice cream. Okay, this one is, is, at least as far as I know, a limited edition, right? The root beer float. Um, uh, I want to say a special thanks to Ryan. Ryan, thank you for telling me about these guys, man. Let's talk about the prices, all right? And I'm going to actually pull up. The first one I'm going to talk about is Fruity Rings with milk and I'm gonna go ahead and pull it up where are ya mm-hmm fruity rings with milk and I believe you can add cream stuff with it now all right here's the sizes you can buy all right 60 mils 20 bucks 125 mils 30 bucks 500 mils 90 bucks Killer prices, man. That's killer prices. Uh, obviously, uh, fruity rings, man. Um, you can get it with milk. Let me let me just see what we got to offer here. You can get it with milk, sweet cream, whipped cream, extra milk, extra sweet cream, or extra whipped cream. All right, you can get fruity rings. And with my case, I just got it with milk, man. Um, when I got each of these liquids, they were pretty clear, dude. Uh, they are really coming to a nice color. Fruity rings. Play a Fruit Loops, man. 
Uh, also, like we always do on this, before we keep going on, I'll let you know what's in the tank because this is my favorite so far. Alright, this is my favorite is in here and I'll let you know at the end after all these. There's a bottle, fruit rings. Fruity rings. Pretty empty. Okay. 50-50 uh, blend on each and every one of these, man. You can get the blends. Uh, dude, you can get it pretty much any way you like. 80 VG, 20 PG, 70 VG, 30 PG, 60 VG, 40 PG, or 50-50. Alright, so I mean there's a lot of different options here. The price is right, man. 35, I think it's 35, 35 shipped, man. So, that's pretty good for 100 mils, dude. Alright, fruity rings, you can imagine. This is exact, to me, this is exactly what it tastes like. You know the milk you drink after you eat a bowl of Fruit Loops. You like take the bowl if you if you like that. Some people don't like drink the milk after. I love it, man. But the milk you drink after you eat it, that's what it tastes like. Man. At first, the lemon was pretty strong. Okay, when I first got it, and I, I like to try it right out of the bottle right when I get it, because usually, like I have a ton of dripping juice, man. Like you guys know, I have a ton, dude. I buy random dripping juices all the time, mainly from Killer Liquid, man. Um, not only do I like their flavor, but I believe that that vapor production is dead on, dude. But, nonetheless, I don't have very much tank juice. This is my all-day stuff. This is what goes out with me, right? I just don't like to blow big clubs in, in public. It's just something I don't like to do. I don't... I just don't do it, okay? It's always a K-Fun on my Hana or Hannah, okay? P. Bissardo, dude. Alright, bro, check this out, man. Respond to this. I want. I need you guys on this one. P. Bissardo, the low vaping, right? Said it's Hana, right? It's not a Hana, like I always called a Hana, Hana mod. It's a Hana mod. Is that right? Nonetheless, out and about. This is what I use. K fun. Actually, I got this uh, fill top right here. The nano kit. Uh, when it comes to vapor production, something like this, it really doesn't matter to me. What matters to me is that the flavor really, you know, uh, hits home. I get great, great, good flavor, but a nice thump. I vape 18 milligram strength. I like that thump. Okay, I need that thump. That's what keeps me out the cigarettes, right? Um, as far as fruity rings goes, at the very first, like I said, it was a little lemony, but as it steeped, it got better and better and better, and each time I dip into it, it's just getting better, man. Um, great way to steep all these juices, a uh, couple days with the lid off in your closet, man. That's what I do, and it's, it's been great, man. Um, I just leave the lid off, let it, some would call it breathing. Uh, either way, that's how I steep my juice, man. Right? Um, but as far as fruit rings with milk goes, that's a go, man. That is a go, all right? It's a fantastic juice. Next up, creamy cake, all right? What's creamy cake? That's no problem, man. Check it out, I got you. Creamy cake is, I believe it's a cupcake, all right? And you can fill it with whatever. All right, yeah, a cream-filled cupcake, all right? And you can fill it and I filled mine with whipped cream. You can fill it with banana cream, Bavarian cream, blueberry cream, chocolate cream, coconut cream, peaches and cream, raspberry cream, strawberry cream, vanilla custard, whipped cream, or caramel, okay? You can fill it with any of those. And I went with whipped cream. All right, um, this was very clear when I got it. Look at that. Ah, the smell of this stuff is... It's like... It's like very good vanilla flavor right but it's very it smells it smells creamy um, now this juice I'm kind of having some trouble with I'm letting it steep man um, so far I have enjoyed it uh, but it, it hasn't it didn't really blow me away right um, but as of right now right, um, I just kind of dripped a little bit and I just to try it one more time right before this review uh, it's really starting to come into its own. That one, 
just keep in mind, if you order the uh, creamy cake, it is going to need some steep time, man, for sure. Definitely, all right? So, plan on that. But, uh, it's, you know what it tastes like? It tastes like a vanilla cupcake. That's what mine tastes like. It just tastes like a vanilla cupcake, all right? It's really nice, man. It's really nice. Is it really cakey, cakey, cakey goodness? Uh, no. No, I wouldn't say that. But I would say it's a nice vanilla-flavored cake vape. Does that make sense? Hopefully it does. Alright. Creamy Jacks. What's Creamy Jacks? I think I already mentioned it a little bit earlier. Creamy Jacks is a play off of Cracker Jacks where you get the prize in the box. Now the thing is with these guys, every time I've get, gotten a package from them, hold on a minute. They send you these little guys. Look at that. Look at this guy. I'm gonna play forward, man. I'm gonna play forward, dude. Check this guy out. It's a little ram. He's chilling, dude. Yeah. So you get these little farm animals in every box, man. All right? Kind of neat and some styrofoam Cheetos as well. But, uh, oh, he's kind of pissed. Check him out. You get a little toy in every box, man. Kind of neat. Crooked? You get a little toy in every box. I like that. It's a nice touch. Now, every time I've written them, I wrote them, and I says, listen, man. I want to review your juices, um, so I, so I ordered. I bought all these. I bought them all out. Um, and what I did is, I would write them. Okay, I test their customer service out, see see what they're about, customer service wise. They answer me every single time, and not only that, they answer me in a handwritten letter. I asked them what their favorites were, what they recommend. All right, um, and one of the recommendations was pineapple upside down cake. All right. I haven't tried it yet, but I'm going to. Alright. Um, but Creamy Jacks. Um, customer service, great, guys. Uh, shipping, great. On time. Now, and he does pour these to order. Okay? So you order it, he makes it, and then he ships it out. So expect like a day delay on the shipping. Alright? So it's not going to go right out the door. It's not sitting there, right? Um, I like that. It's nice. It's nice. You know what I mean? Okay, Creamy Jacks. This one, my girlfriend's favorite, dude. She's pissed. We're almost out. I already ordered another bottle. Alright. Um, popcorn, caramel, nuts. That's what I get from this. You get this intense, very intense, nutty caramel, right? And it's really nice, but that popcorn is just... You know what I mean? It's almost like you've been gnawing on some pop, just, just banging on these things, just oh, pop, just caramel popcorn, and there's nuts all over it, dude. It is amazing. That is a fantastic juice. That one is a go, all right? Creamy Jacks, dude. That is a definite go, man. Um, like I said, my girlfriend's all day, man. Uh, she, already, she just straight up told me that. She's like, we just need you need to keep it in the house, and I'm going to, of course. You got it. Gotta make the girl happy, man. Um, but yeah, Creamy Jacks, definite go. Uh, fruity rings with milk, for me, definite go, guys. Uh, creamy cake, just be prepared to steep it. That's also a really good juice, actually. Um, one more, man. Alright. Root beer float with extra ice cream. Alright. Let's back it up, man. Let's back it up. Now the root beer float, like it, like it said, when I bought this, it was a, a limited edition, man. All right. Um. But it seems to, it doesn't say it underneath it anymore, so I'm hope, I'm hoping he doesn't. Anyway. Um. Now extra ice cream, yes or no? Okay, and it's a dollar extra for the extras. All right. So if you want like. Fruity rings with milk, the milk is free. If you add extra milk, it's a dollar. Okay? Okay? Just so you guys know, man. Um, root beer, 
float with extra ice cream is the dankest of the dank, dude. Like, the dankest of the dank. Right? Holy shit. That, that is a fantastic juice, man. That's what's in here. Absolute favorite. I don't know if Dr. Krimi's will be watching this review, but if you are, do please keep this on the site, man. Please. This is a fantastic juice, man, and it should be around constantly. And it's just getting better and better. Here's what I get. This fizzy root beer, I swear to God. You can get that, uh, carbonate, that carbonation flavor, right? Light root beer flavor. Really light, and then this almost custard just kind of after it. You know what I mean? At the very end on the exhale, you get a beautiful, mellow, dense custard, dude. It is so goddamn good. This is fantastic, man. Big bottle. Uh, as a matter of fact, I think I might be buying the 500 mil. <laughs> yeah, pretty sure. An absolute beautiful thing here, guys. It, it really is. The Ruber float with either whether you get ice cream or not. I don't know. I just got extra ice cream in mine, and that's how, what I would recommend to you guys. All right. Um, As you can see, quite a bit left in it. It's got it in 918. All right, not too old, man, and it's already this good. Uh, it is fantastic. As soon as I get down to where Creamy Jacks is, my Creamy Jacks bottle is, I probably got a few tanks left. Yeah. Let me see. Yeah, okay. Yeah. As soon as I get down to there, I'll definitely order some more of that. Um, Burger Flow with extra ice cream. Overall, the experience I've had with Krimi's has been fantastic. Great customer service. They answer everything. Anything I've ever sent them, asked them, hit them up. It doesn't matter. They get back to me. Like, when I wrote, when you, you have a comment section, you kind of leave a comment or whatnot. And I left comments in there. And I never really heard back from them, right? So it's kind of like, all right, all right. You know, it's just one of those things, you know. Because they wrote it, a hand letter to me. Uh, each person, right? And I don't know if this is a one-man operation or two-man, but I believe it was him and his wife, I want to guess, okay? Um, they each wrote what they liked, man. You know, and, and they've just always answered me. And that's great, man. So good on you guys, man. Fantastic juice. Highly recommended for me. Price is right. The flavor is excellent. Um, you know, you're robbing them, man. That's such a great price point. It's unreal. Um... I'm very happy with it, and I'll be ordering a lot of this shit. Let's talk live show. A lot of people bummed out they missed the last one. Let's do another one real soon, man. Maybe this weekend. Maybe, maybe, maybe this weekend. Okay? Maybe tomorrow morning? Okay? Time will tell it. Keep an eye out, man. Keep an eye on my feed. If you see one go up, you know what's on, man. And I hope you guys can make it. Uh, I figured maybe the weekend, like a weekend, like a Saturday or Sunday, you guys would have more of an opportunity to, to make it, you know. That was a lot of fun last time. We hung out. Um, it was just really cool. Got to answer questions and really get to hang out with you guys. That, that really was really fucking cool, man. I uh, was super stoked, uh, and I can't wait to do it again. Um, so there we go, man. Short video, maybe. It might be. I don't know. Uh, short and sweet, to the point. Yeah, yeah. I haven't even showered yet. I just grabbed the video camera and just went to it. So, excuse the skies, guys. Excuse the skies, man. Excuse the skies. <laughs> I would end this in the cloud, but I don't think I'm going to today. The dripper's way over there. Should I? Should I go get it? Yeah. I'll go get it. What's it? This build, at a point you don't want to know, we'll bust that one out. 
Well, we always end in the cloud, right? I just keep it next to me when I do e-juice reviews. I don't do many e-liquid reviews. And I got I got some more coming up. Uh, Vapor Jungle, I believe. Uh, I got some juice coming up for you guys, man. I hope I hope you guys can make it to those, man. Cause I really enjoy hanging out and chilling, having a vape with you, man. All right, let's drip in some juice. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions whatsoever, man, you can email me at tjvapingreviews at aol.com, man. Go ahead and email me. I try to get back to everybody. If I've missed you, email me again, okay? I have had some missed uh, emails, all right? So email me again if you haven't heard from me, dude. If you haven't heard from me, there's a problem there. Um, or comment down below, man. I try to get back to everybody. It's becoming a lot harder to keep up with everybody these days, but I'm grinding, man. I'm grinding, so... Hang in there, alright? Thanks, guys. So much for joining me. Let's end this. Classic form, man. Classic. <laughs>